1 John says, perfect love casts out all fear. And what I've realized is love casting out, uh, love covering a multitude of sins and casting out fear. When you start to love people, when you really love people, fear will seem to just drop away, just start to fall away. And the, the mistakes of others that you love and care about will become less and less. And when they receive that love, they'll grow. You know why I changed is because Jesus loved me just the way I was, not the way I should be or could be. And it was a love that transformed me. It wasn't rules and regulations. It wasn't people telling me that I was gonna go to hell. It was people who finally at 20, because I thought God hated me until then, told me to read Galatians and then Romans. Those books changed my life. And I realized something called love and grace. And it changed me forever. The echo is awesome. <laughs> I did, someone tweeted me about it. I couldn't do anything about it. Sorry, guys. <laughs> God so loved the world, he gave his son. And the son gave us grace. Thank God for grace. It truly is amazing. And it is my life to tell people about grace. See, I grew up in a church where we didn't talk much about grace and we didn't even know what the word meant. I thought it was a song. Amazing grace. Okay, it's a song. And then when I found out what it was, that God loved me and accepted me, and you know, because I thought I had to earn it. And when I realized, see, don't take it for granted that you know it's a free gift, that you got this crazy Lutheran guy who comes along and all of a sudden discovers grace, Martin Luther, and starts telling people about grace and how much God loves them. Don't take it for granted because there's millions of Christians out there suffering who don't feel like God loves them. And they're, they're, they're dying to know they're loved. And if it wasn't for a friend of mine pointing that out, I don't know where I would be now. 